of the mechanical interface indicator is off. Copy. We are expecting SSVP mode completed message. Copy. SSVP mode complete on message is there and we have physical separation. Undocking confirmed right on time at 2.14 p.m. Central Time as the International Space Station flew over the southern tip of South America. The hooks open uh, messages on copy and uh, the target is off uh, one degree to the right, half a degree B down, the attitude is nominal, S12 is on, inaudible speaking at the same time. Yes, we, yes, we turn our vacuum. Uh, at a rate of one-tenth of a meter per second, the Soyuz slowly backing away from the aft port of Zvezda. Sixteen meters, one six, and we are performing the roll maneuver. We have uh, rotated by forty-five degrees, and we are proceeding. Twenty-five meters range. SSVP is uh, being deactivated. We have started the VIPS, SSVP is being deactivated, Michael go ahead and deactivate it, SSVP is off. Okay, Michael, you can go ahead and speak for yourself. SSVP is off. SSVP is off. SSV mode is completed, is not on. SSVP is being turned on. The indicator is on, Moscow inaudible. And we are approaching the 30 minute, uh, rather the 30 meter. Reference point, copy. Turin reporting uh, that they're almost at the proper distance uh, behind uh, the Zvezda service module's aft docking port to begin the lateral translation over to the Zarya module. To enter the program, yes, we are ready. We are in the hold mode. Program 3 is sent, is input it at 20 minutes after, and the, I'm activating the display. And uh, be prepared for the fly be prepared for the fly around. We copy and work. Thirty two meters range and uh, we are accelerating to the fly over the velo fly around velocity. At a distance of 32 meters directly behind the Zvezda service module, Mikhail Turin now will be firing jets to begin the maneuver over to the 30-meter uh, distance point uh, between uh, the Soyuz TMA-9 and the uh, Zarya module. Kadu parameters are nominal. We are completing the flyover. We have, uh, that spacecraft uh, in your field of view is the uh, ISS Progress 22 cargo ship that is docked to the Piers docking compartment. It arrived at the International Space Station a few months ago with supplies for the crew on board the complex. The uh, Soyuz TMA-9 and the Expedition 14 crew now uh, coming into view uh, just uh, over the limb of the Earth as uh, Mikhail Tiran continues his flyover. And uh, we are now at the PEGO FGB level. And uh, let us introduce some roll correction, and it's going to be even better. 
Once uh, the Soyuz has redocked uh, to the uh, Earth-facing port of the Zarya module, that should be the final uh, resting place uh, for the Soyuz until next spring when it undocks one final time to bring home Mike Lopez Alegria and Mikhail Turin after a half year in space. On the lower right-hand uh, portion of your screen is uh, the end effector, uh, the latching end effector of the uh, Canadarm2, the space station's robotic arm. We have accelerated the fly around uh, velocity, and it's a very interesting sound, actually. When the thrusters fire, it's almost as if somebody is taking a drumstick and banging on the hull a little bit. At 29 minutes, the station is in the docking configuration. Very good. We can feel the station in the OS car, so we have to maintain the lateral component a little bit. But the station is pretty accurate, and I'm trying not to use the thrusters. I have found the angular, uh, the proper angular velocity. Okay, very good. And we are in the docking configuration. Yes, very good. We copy. And uh, 25 ra meters range. We can see the station clearly, I can see the target clearly. I don't see the reason not to go ahead and uh, dock. Display TV should be activated. That is program three. Okay, very good. It looks like everything is nominal. It's almost dark outside. Turin is actually waiting uh, for the uh, orbital sunset uh, to be uh, in effect so his eyes can adjust uh, to the uh, nighttime conditions prior to resuming final approach. And uh, please go ahead and report what's happening. Range 10 meters. Copy. We have good alignment. We can see that the alarm is good. The radio rate is about uh, two to three tenths. The control is of the vehicle is good. The lateral velocity has been taken care of. Very good. We have very good alignment. Yes, but what? We have the contact. Docking confirmed. Docking confirmed at 2.34 p.m. Central Time as the two spacecraft passed over the west coast of Africa at an altitude of 222 statute miles. We don't have the capture yet. And uh, we don't see it on the display TV. The SM probe is extended, indicator is off. We have the contact, the thruster has fired, a recar is off, we deactivate rot, the route is off, 